Go on a trip in a partially renovated RV, she said. It'll be fun, she said. Well, we made it to South Padre Island, and then we ran into a bit of a problem, quite a significant problem, actually, with our electrical system. So we had to stay the night in a hotel. First night in South Padre in a hotel. Well, howdy there. Welcome back to Gorn and Jen. We are in the midst of our second RV trip. We are in Texas right now, headed to Lufkin, I believe. Yes. And uh, it's been quite the journey thus far. We had a lot to do to get this Airstream ready to go for our second trip. If you have watched our 28 days of Airstream renovation, you will know that we've put in a ton of work, but still have a lot of things to do. So we had a couple little things that we had to do to get this RV ready to go for this trip. And I will tell you what those are once Goran comes back and tells me where my nail bag is. <laughs> also, the boys say hi. Hey, hey guys, thanks for watching. 26 weeks tomorrow. So before we left, we had to finish a few things. And one of those things was roof sealant because there was a huge leak. So we put some of this uh, Dicor roof tape on it. Uh, we had to do a lot of cabinet work. So we painted the cabinets. We put on the new hardware. We had to paint some of the areas where the cabinet doors would go. And then we had to actually mount the cabinets, the cabinet doors, I should say. Fixed a leaky shower. That was a huge thing that ended up being an easy fix, thank God. We serviced the AC unit. That was fun. And got a new bed because sleeping on an air mattress sucks. Our first stop was Benton KOA. Stayed there for a night. AC worked great, but we uh, had a couple of issues. The whole face of our back cabinet fell off. Uh, that was, of all the things we were expecting to break in this Airstream, that was nowhere on our list. And also our water heater kind of pooped out on us. So. We are going to be taking cold showers in that fresh new shower that we fixed. It's great. Love it. Go on a trip in a partially renovated RV, she said. It'll be fun, she said. That's true. I did say that. Anyways, on to the next stop. We'll see you there. I'll have a solo. <laughs> Good morning. It is about 6.30 a.m. and we are getting ready to head to our final destination today. Yesterday we drove about 10 and a half hours, which is way too long, but we had to make up some time so it was necessary. Pulled into Lufkin KOA in Texas. It's really nice. Seems like they're doing some new construction. The pull-through sites are great. The back-end sites are great. Really, really new. Has a little pond and, of course, the cabins that are always here at these KOAs and it's pretty nice so I would recommend it if you are stopping through. Anywho, we need to get a move on, make some coffee, and head to our final destination which is about seven and a half hours away. Also, our water heater started working again so maybe it didn't break in the first place. Hmm, seems kind of temperamental but I guess that's what you get for a 30 plus year old water heater. Delicious? Better than Starbucks. <laughs> it is Starbucks. All right, guys. It's before 8 a.m. We're actually being successful in our plans to leave early today. I mean, I don't know about early, but hey, early-ish. It's earlier. It's an hour and a half earlier than yesterday. That's true. All right, let's hit these streets. Well, we made it to South Padre Island and got all checked in to our KOA. And then we ran into a bit of a problem, quite a significant problem actually with our electrical system. So we had to stay the night in a hotel. First night in South Padre in a hotel. So today we need to go and fix this problem. Otherwise we might have to go home. Next time on Gorn and Jen, we go on a mission to find electrical parts for our Airstream, explore South Padre Island, 
and check out SpaceX. Be sure to like and subscribe to join our community. We'll see you next time. What's that? We're doing the one finger drive. It's a feature from Ford. <laughs> one finger drive.